Hey guys, got another video for you today. Uh, this is going to be a quick review on a piece of gear that I found recently and I've been actually EDCing for the past couple days. Um, it's something that I've picked up because of um, you know a lot of information and feedback that I got from watching a lot of uh, videos here on YouTube, uh, especially videos of you know people like us that like to carry knives uh, on our EDC and for everyday purposes. Um, what I did notice was a common trend and uh, the majority of the people that say that they carry a knife generally say, you know, I carry my knife and I use it to open up boxes at work or I open up to, you know, cut, cut down boxes or open up envelopes and whatnot. Now, um, a lot of people like myself do carry two knives, uh, maybe one for personal protection and the other one for just EDC everyday um, things that you would use a knife for. Now, I, I, you know, I know myself, I really hate using my EDC knife to open up boxes, even though that's in its intended purposes. Um, but that's because, you know, it, it kind of dulls the blade really, really fast. And, you know, I have to go ahead and retouch it and things like that. So, you know, even though I like doing that, it, it can become a little bit of a hassle doing it every day. So um, what's the alternative? Well, maybe carrying something like this. Now, this is your everyday run-of-the-mill, um, uh, you know, knife. Uh, exacto knife, utility knife, I, sh I should say. Um, you know, it's got the blades, uh, it's got the uh, the aluminum handle, and you know, just um, you know, just what you would find, um, you know, just regular people that use these to open up boxes for. Now, the drawback on this is one, not very tactical; two, very bulky, very big; uh, three, just not really cool looking. So, you know, obviously, this isn't something that the majority of us would be ca carrying around. Um, I did find this little guy um, at Sears. This is a Craftsman. Um, it's pretty much the same thing, a utility knife, um, but it's a, it's, a, it's a folder and it locks open. Uh, it uses a, the smaller blades, not, not the, uh, the standard size, but smaller blades. Uh, it's pretty cool. I put this little paracord at the end over there. It's got these, uh, these nice uh, aluminum scales on it, uh, lock back. So as you can see, you just press right here and it locks back. Obviously, definitely a lot smaller. Um, great, you know, it'll fit in your pocket or whatnot. But again, um, just not not as useful because of its size. Um, and you know, the blades you do have to go on and purchase those particular blades which aren't which aren't as readily accessible as the standard size. So, um, you know, I, I went out and found you know something that's kind of like in the middle, and this is what I found. Uh, this is uh, it's the Gerber EAB Light. And EAB stands for Exchange a Blade. Uh, this is actually a, uh, a new design for their 2010 catalog. Um, and basically, it's, uh, it's a utility knife like uh, one of those two. But it's got a little bit more of a tactical twist to it. Uh, as you guys can see, it's, uh, it's made out of steel. Um, very, very sturdy. And it's got this pocket clip right here. And it's got you know the word Gerber um, you know, imprinted on the pocket clip. So right off the bat, you know, it's got a plus on those two that it has a pocket clip. You can definitely clip it onto your pocket. Um, it's very, very thin, very thin profile on it, which is what I like. Uh, it's got this little screw right here, which can actually double, um, you know, maybe maybe it doubles a thumb stud, but you know, um, it, it's obviously used to secure the blade. It opens up, and uh, as you guys can see, uh, it uses the standard blades, which is the plus. Uh, you don't have to go out and buy the, the little tiny ones. Um, it's got great um, finger grooves right here so it gives you a really secure fit and it actually brings it all the way up here so if you want to definitely choke up on the blade by bringing your finger up here you could do so as well and you've got a little guard right there so your fingers not going to slip on the blade now this portion right here which would keep the blade in you know in place actually serves to put your thumb up there so if you really want to choke in on something you can do so and not worry about your you know your thumb meeting the blade anywhere um, really, really comfortable in the hand. Um, it's a great fit. Um, it gives you a lot more purchase than the little one does, but it definitely fits just right and not like the bigger one. Uh, it looks a lot cooler also, obviously. Um, it's a liner lock. It's got a lock right here, so you just press down on that and you know it releases the blade, folds back into place. Now the cool thing is also that it has the pocket clip. It also doubles as a money clip. So if you wanted to throw some money on there and use it as a money clip, you could do so as well. Um, or again, if not, if you just want to drop it into a pocket, you know, you're good to go. Um, I don't know the exact weight on this, but it's very, very light, even though it's, it's all stainless steel. It's, uh, it's really light. Um, you know, it's, it's obviously um, a lot more discreet looking than, you know, carrying something like this. Um, it's a lot more useful than carrying something like that. 
And what's good about it is um, it can definitely couple with anybody's EDC. Um, if you definitely need it to cut open a box or whatnot, you know, I would reach for this, uh, leave the, uh, the blade on my life and my knife be a little bit more, um, sharp than, um, than dulling it up by opening up boxes, you know? So, um, I think this retails for about 14, $14, $15 around there. Uh, you can find it online for about $9. So for $9, it's a great addition to any EDC. Um, you can, you know, you can throw it into a pocket, clip it onto a pocket and, you know, you just have, you know, something obviously it's it's more discreet than pulling out your knife um it's not going to scare a lot of people you know it, it just looks like a box cutter you know a utility knife and um you know you don't have people giving you second looks uh, about you know, whipping out your knife to break down a box um and at the end of the day you know you know you're gonna have a, a really um, sharp edge on your knife um and this one right here if it dolls up you know all you have to do is unscrew it right here pull that blade out flip it around and, you know you got an, a spare blade there and once it's done, you can take that out and just slide another one. So it's the beauty of having the uh, the standard blades on there. So great, great little knife. Again, this is the Gerber EAB Lite. EAB is Exchange Blade. Um, it's a new model for 2010. So uh, I definitely suggest you guys look at it, especially uh, if you're the type of person like myself that carries a knife for um, you know for cutting down boxes or, or you know doing doing uh, tasks that maybe you don't want to use your uh, your regular knife for. So maybe you could substitute one of your knives for this and then just carry this and then uh you know um a personal defense knife if you had to uh you know that's that's also an option so let me know if you have any questions guys all right thanks